We're at Ka New York Caribbean Carnival VIP Breakfast at Lincoln Terrace Park. This year is keeping culture alive. Reggae, Afrobeats, Soca Under the Stars at the Brooklyn Museum Grounds. Highlights from the West Indian American Day Carnival 2018. Teal Band Panorama 2018. Season rice Beautiful. with a jerk twist with a celebrity family. chef Patrick Simpson on this week's In the Kitchen. Perfect juice to go with this. Some lemonade. Don't get it twisted. You don't know. It's the West Indian American Labor Day weekend. Yeah, and we're at the Parkway here in Brooklyn. See, and the energy is very nice as you can see. Let's take a look. Holy Picasso, music's playing, food I eat, people are dance. It's just a fun day. Seeing right here at the 2018 West Indian American Carnival. Come chat to me with the Ziggy Bless. Keep it locked. Today, we're at the West Indian American Day Carnival. And this is the, the VIP breakfast segment of the carnival. All right, so keep it locked. Ziggy Bless, with the come chat with me. You hear me? on being the president I feel very excited and elated yes, very very nice very nice and today is a VIP breakfast um first why we why do we keep a breakfast um in before um the event well after we do this then this is really the culmination of our five-day event so we end it with a breakfast and then from here we walk down the parade I mean down Eastern Parkway um, for the parade this is the uh, third anniversary of Carrie Gabay's death. Carrie Gabay was as beautiful a person as you're going to find. Worked himself up, public housing to Harvard University, worked in public service. He was magnificent. 
and uh, to pointlessly lose his life uh, just reminds us of the unnecessary violence, the unnecessary death, and the continued insanity of a society that spends so much money to lock people up rather than investing in them to prevent the problems in the first place. The Cary Gabay Center is going to transform the Bedford Armory. It's 60,000 square feet and it's going to be a multi-service center uh, to provide an alternative to the streets. It's going to be in his honor. Brooklyn, make some noise! New York Caribbean Carnival Week 2018, presented by the West Indian American Day Carnival Association, kicks off with reggae, Afrobeats, soca, under the stars. Reggae Under the Stars was complete with Afro-Caribbean roots, rhythm and reggae, full of vibes. With a unique lineup, Charlie Black from Jamaica, Naila Blackman from Trinidad, Aya J from Nigeria, Aquel J from Jamaica, Papa Whiskey from Ghana, and William Howard, as you all know, he passed away recently, and you know, Carnival is something, a big deal to all of us, and we know he's watching us, so we just want to keep the music down, and we want to have a moment of silence right now, please bow your heads. For 2018, uh, we had just lost our president, however, we are trying to pick up the pieces and make sure that whatever is done is even better than last year. Because we want to make to honor him and to make sure that we are not dead, we are alive. Yes, this is the Southern Comfort coming to you live from Reggae Under the Stars. Reggae Under the Stars with the Southern Comfort. Come and get some of y'all sweet potato waffles and delicious fried chicken. What a beautiful event. We're celebrating. Listen to the music. Music alone can do this, you know. All over the world, I go and travel. Music is the only thing that gets all nations together. Not even politicians are powerful like music. So I'm very grateful to be here and be a part of this culture. Tonight performance is a very tricky one. I would say that it is simple because I perform in, to, um, in front of a crowd that I don't normally perform in, in front of. So it was kind of tricky. So we have to adjust our set. And as I said, um, Caribbean people adjust to any situation. I'm from Jamaica, so we understand the whole thing. So tonight was a night where 
hard to get into my performance. I mean, it was not even 40 minutes, but if if it is longer, trust me, the father will be stronger. Blackman and it's my very first time here in New York for Labor Day Carnival and I'm so ecstatic my performance just now was exhilarating I love coming to New York I love performing in front of the people I love how diverse the culture is and I just had fun on stage I mean it's not everywhere a crowd can make you feel welcome and have fun you know what I mean so that was amazing it's my very first performance for Labor Day so I'm ecstatic to see how the rest of the weekend goes what's the name yeah you enjoying the carnival you see the party there, yeah, yeah. the party bono, party bono. You see the party there, yeah. the party, hey. the party lit, party lit, the party lit, party lit, the party turn up, turn up, turn up, the party lit, the party lit, the party lit. Yeah, yeah man, you don't know, man. Yeah. The carnival up right now. We're there. A full jar we sell, brother. What going? We're there, no sick. Yeah, <laughs> both a broad and yard. We're there. Our oh, day this in a Brooklyn Eastern Parkway. Yeah. Coming live. So you love the vibes so far? Yeah, the vibes. Turn up. I am joyous today. I here playing with Blue Blue, yeah. Traditional Mass, yeah. Midnight Robber, Dame Lorraine, Blue Jab. We just want to remind people yeah. that Carnival is more than beads and feathers. Yeah. It has plenty stories behind it. So I'm very excited to be here. Eh? Yeah, I see. Thank you. <laughs> the best flag in the world. You see the pretty? Yeah. Grenada right through. Best flag in the world. Hey, look at look at the prettiness. But Jamaica prettier than it, man. No, you don't have a look at look at that yellow and look at Jamaica yellow. Pretty. I hear my brother. The red like the sun. I hear my brother. No, no black. Panorama, a key part of the big New York Caribbean Carnival, presented by the West Indian American Day Carnival Association. Enjoy the rhythms of sweet steel band music as New York City's finest steel orchestras compete to win the 2018 Panorama Championship crown. Arranging for steel band entails taking a one to three minute uh, popular tune, usually a calypso or soca from the current year of Panorama, and making that into a ten minute arrangement that consists of a harmonic development, motivic development, uh, the use of motifs in general, uh, general performance, uh, what we do with an intro, um, how we variate any verses or choruses, and we do all these things while trying to capture the, the audience's attention, um, trying to keep the players happy, and, um, and then trying to please the judges. So I think the, arranger, the arranger's position is an interesting one now that I think about it. How did you feel performing tonight? Very good. I think we have a good chance of winning this panorama. Um, on stage, the energy was really great. The, the players execute the song like we want them to, so I think we have a great chance of winning this panorama tonight. We play a song by voice called Yeah for Love, which basically we want to spread love with our, in, in the community and just give love to everybody. So what's your role in this band? Well, I'm the manager of the band. I basically make sure everything from the arrangers fine, players are fine, 
move again the, the equipment so I basically manage everything make sure everything is in order Our fathers built Despots USA, man. Okay. Our fathers built them. I don't, let me tell you something. I don't know what a regular summer in New York is like, as well as him. We don't know. Right. You understand? Because Pan took us out the streets, everything. Our Panorama Champions 2018 with a score of 463, Despots USA. Welcome. You're watching In the Kitchen with celebrity chef Patrick Sims. You don't know what's the game is. My brother, what are going to the man? Where are going? Yo, man, listen, man. We're changing up the game this week. And this week, you know, over there, In the Kitchen. What you been up to, man? I know you've been doing a whole lot of stuff, man. You've been super busy. I already was on the parkway oh, the other day. How was it? Lovely, man. Big up to all the people on the parkway who show me love. <laughs> Love, love and respect. See? But you see right now, I in the kitchen with her. We know love the segment set speed. We know can't wait. See it now, chef. Talk to them. Yo, listen man, where do I fry rice? Where do I season rice? Fry rice. The other day I missed something on social media and a man saying make jerk rice. Mm. It just go crazy and people are wonder like jerk rice or what kind of thing that. So me I do my little own twist. Kinda of after that, I'm gonna do a season rice and I'm gonna do a jerk twist to it. In, in the kitchen. kitchen. Alright guys, so I put my onion in, my scallion, and I'm putting a little bit of thyme in. And I'm gonna also go with a little bit of tomato. Alright guys, looking real good. I'm gonna also go with some fresh garlic. I'm gonna go with some fresh garlic and I'm gonna allow it to sit. I'm gonna allow it to marinate a little bit. Just let it season a little bit. Looking real good. I'm gonna go with some garlic powder. I'm gonna also go with some Old Bay season. As you know already, I like my food to be nice and flavorful. So I never hold back on the seasoning. I always go hard on the seasoning. Nice pepper flakes. All right. I have the rice already pre-cooked. So the next thing I'm gonna add now is my meat. And my meat, I have some shrimp and I have some chicken already pre-diced and pre-cooked. Looking real good. One of the ingredients I'm gonna add is also, I'm gonna add some salmon. I'm gonna add some salmon to this, but I'm gonna wait until the last minute to actually have the salmon because I don't want the salmon to break up. I want everything to look real good. I don't want the salmon to break up, so I'm gonna have that as a last minute. All right? So, as I said, with the jerk flavor, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna draw from my Walker's wood right here, and I'm gonna go with the jerk barbecue. The jerk barbecue, I'm just gonna add a little bit into it. That's gonna give me that nice little barbecue and jerk flavor. And then I'm gonna go for my stir fry sauce. This is my stir fry sauce I'm adding in. My stir fry. I'm shooting for a nice flavor, a nice sharpness out of the flavor. So most definitely. And with this, it's real simple and it's really easy. Like if you're home and you have some leftover from the night before, this is something that you can do to use up your leftover that you have. A one pot meal and I tell you the kids will love this your husband will love this your wife will love this and it's nice and flavorful and that's what we're shooting for beautiful break up my rice 
I'm gonna still allow it to kind of dry down a little bit. Let it dry down a little bit. And then I'm gonna fold in my rice. See? Nice. That's what I'm talking about. Played in and presentation. So if you look at that, you see how, how juicy that look and how flavorful that look. That's what you call that one pot meal. Rice, chicken, shrimp, one pot meal. Something simple, different, and this allow you to utilize a lot of stuff that you have in the house to put this together. With a little bit of olive oil, sprinkle right over the top, just to give it that nice little sheen and that nice little burst of flavor when you dig into it. All right, guys, you see that? Simple, easy, and this is something that you can make. Just a typical one-pot meal. I saw them call it a Jamaica, one-pot meal. Season rice, the jerk style. Perfect jerk. Stay connected with Come Chat With Me. Like us on Facebook, follow us on Twitter and Instagram. Thanks for watching Come Chat With Me. Tune in each and every Sunday right here on CIN. See you next week. Love the parade, the people and the food. <laughs> Everything is good, man. Yeah, man. Every nice vibe. Nice vibes and thing, you know, like the vibes. Everything cool, everything cool. Retrospecting the VI, don't know. See it? They said the VI. Oh, VI, Virgin Islands. What island are you representing? Today? Jamaica. Why Jamaica? Because we are the best. You were born in Jamaica? No, my father was. What's your name, mommy? My name is Godison, Daphne Godison. Okay, mommy, you say every Sunday you watch us. Yeah. Sunday, nice. no Sunday never passed, my man. No Sunday. Nice, nice. And what island are you representing? Jamaica. Jamaica to the world, man. All right, mommy. Thank you very much and keep watching. All right. Love your brother. Love, Love you, mommy. Thanks very much. Thank you very much. <laughs> Simply kills.